Hello, I'm Amber Uper, and this is a model kit review. And as you can see, this is a model of the C-47 Skytrain, the World War II workhorse of the air transport system. And this particular kit is in 172nd scale, and it's made by Italeri of Italy. So let's take a look at the box here. And first we've got the description of the plane in a bunch of different languages. And here's one end of the box. And then you got over here, it shows some uh, pictures of what's inside the box. And then over here, you've got that. So, let's open up the box and see what's in it. Alright, well, here's your instructions. We'll get to them in a minute. Here's your decals. Now, these here's the American decals. Got them upside down. So you can see them. Or maybe I do. I had them up. There we go. <laughs> had them right the first time. So there's that. And then you've got the British decals, in case you want to decal it for that. And uh, this is a relatively new model, so the decals are in really good condition. I'd say this is a new production model, just judging by the box and the quality of the decals and the, the writing on the box and all of that. And the fact that it says on the box, Boeing officially licensed product. You wouldn't have seen that in the 19... In the 1990s or whatever. Okay, so anyway, here's the instructions for the Dakota C-47 Skytrain. In different languages, uh, let's see, it just discusses the plane. So, we open it up. There we go. Here's your sprue. Um, pictures to how to find the parts you're looking for, and the parts are all numbered. And so we'll go to the assembly. And step one is the interior of the fuselage. You've got the bulkheads here and your uh, pilot uh, area, the, the cockpit area, your uh, instrument control panel, all of the parts. So then we go to part two. And here's the body halves, and you're basically putting this into the body halves. And your lower wing centerpiece, outer doors, your um, horizontal tail surfaces. And then we go to four, and it shows the wings uh, assembly. And your landing gear, the front landing gear anyway. And then we get into... An, uh, step four, you get into the engine assemblies here. And number five, it shows a couple of different types of, of um, the engine covers for uh, different versions, I guess, of the plane. And um, also assembling a lot of other, um, the little details on the outer surface. So then we will fold this over, and here's your painting instructions. It's the American version and the British version. So that uh, that's your instructions. All right. Now, since it, the parts are all in the bag, I'm gonna have to open the bag. So let's do that. Let's put the box over here. Oh, bag is open. Don't have to. All right, let me just slide all the parts out. Now, the, uh, the clear plastic is still in the bag. It's kind of hard to show you that, but it's always hard to show you the clear plastic parts. They just don't show up well on the camera. So then we got two sprues of parts. We'll talk about this one first. So here is your lower wing centerpiece goes under the body and here's your upper wing pieces and your lower wing pieces and you can tell these are the upper wing because here's the uh, engine nacelles with the um, spaces for the landing gear and then this just goes on top of that so and then you got your 
landing gear wheels. Here's your rear horizontal um, wing surfaces. A couple of your interior bulkheads. Looks like a couple of muffler pieces there. And probably the instrument cluster here. Instrument panel. So we'll put that over there. And then what do we got here? Here's your two body halves, obviously. Here's the interior. And apparently the seats are already on the interior floor piece. Um, engine cowlings. Here's your parts to the two engines. Each one of these is a double row radial. Here's a different set of engine cowlings or possibly just the other half. Propeller here, propeller there. And then we've got a side door. Here's the big door in the back. This would be one version of it. And here's the small door that goes in this area. And I think that's just the way it's set up to be made. Um, I believe these are the pilot seats. Obviously your two uh, pilots, your figures. Uh, landing gear parts, landing gear parts, exterior parts. And let's see, tail wheel, other exterior parts here. And that's all there really is to the parts in this thing. Being a 172nd scale model, it doesn't have a lot of interior detail, but that's pretty typical of 172nd scale um, airplane models. But it's still a pretty good model. I mean, you know, you're still going to end up with a, uh, a quality 172nd scale model when you're done. And of course, that depends on how good you are at painting and whatever. But it's still a, a good uh, kit. Nicely detailed kit. So we're going to put all this stuff back in here. We can do the bag like that. Instructions. And your decals. And that is my kit review for the Italeri C47 Skytrain in 172nd scale. Kit number 127. Thanks for watching.